Visually, it's probably not going to look very different because the formal evolution tends to be very slow. What I would like to see is more typographic sophistication in across media, really, because what we have now is that type itself is getting a lot smarter and is able to do much more than it used to be. Um, and on the other hand, that is not always used in the best way or actually leveraged in all media because you still see fonts used in the wrong contexts or kind of just not optimally chosen. And, and that, I think, is, is maybe one of the bigger things that, that keeps type from just being as good as it is. So that's kind of my main thing is imagining type designers and typographers to work together more and to kind of bridge that to really achieve an optimum of quality across all media. I think the main problem in font technology that we have suffered from for too long is rectangles. This kind of idea that we're still glued to from, from the days of metal type that, you know, letters sit on rectangular bits of space, which creates a huge lot of problems. It creates, you know, the need for, for manual kerning, which is ridiculous if you think about it. Um, and it makes all sorts of problems, obviously, for complex scripts. And I think open type is, you know, on another technological level, a great step towards you know making more things possible, as opposed to you know the old days of metal. But I think in this, in this central point, we're still stuck to that old metaphor, and and I wonder if it has to be that way. I'm wondering how much intelligence could be baked into a font format itself, so that it the, the font itself would be able to respond in some way to its surroundings. For example, thinking about um, optical sizes, you know, could a font recognize when it's being scaled down and, you know, switch or interpolate towards a, a version that works better in smaller sizes? Is this something that we want to happen in a font format, to take that task away from the hands of, of people who would have to implement it manually? It's a question. I don't know if that's an optimal way, but it's something I would, I like to fantasize about.